that we designed for a uh, class that was part of a Google Hangout where the students were going to be visited by um, the author of an article that they had been reading and the teacher wanted them to um, first uh, brainstorm some questions for that teacher and then collaboratively take notes um, on different aspects of her interview uh, while the interview was going on and then to bring those notes together at the end of the class. So uh, we'll start by preloading some note topics. Uh, this is a teacher-only activity. We'll brainstorm some questions. Um, we will use these topics to distribute them among groups that we generate randomly and uh, we'll have them work on the notes and then we'll bring all the notes together at the end. So um, first I'm going to start by uh, going into a teacher mode and preloading some, um, some headlines. So in the future we'll have a better way of pre-configuring um, activities with the content, but for now this works quite well as well. So for example, I'll just add four different uh, topics here. So I've uh, created here a list. Um, these are actually um, these uh, text area documents, so um, they can be edited. And what we'll simply do is we'll send these out to the different students and we'll have them edit these documents and then we'll move them along um, to the final uh, view where we can see them all again. So I've got four students logged in uh, just for the demo. And uh, when we start with the first uh, activity, the four students can uh, brainstorm some questions. So as you'll see, this is a whole class activity. That means uh, the, all the students see the questions as soon as they're added. Um, we can still uh, edit the answers. And of course, this is updating in real time. Uh, the students can then uh, collaboratively uh, vote up the questions that they find the most interesting. And uh, we have then a sorted list of questions that we can share with the interview, the interview room. Now, during the interview, the teacher wanted the students to um, take notes, but instead of having a single document for the whole class, he chose a few uh, different topics and wanted small groups of students to focus on different topics. So uh, now we see here that the four students, um, because we only have four, are assigned to the four different groups and they have uh, these documents are preloaded with uh, the topics that they need to focus on. So uh, so as the interview is going on, the students can collaborate here. And uh, once the interview is over, the teacher can go to the next activity and we then gather all the documents together and we can now uh, continue as a whole class uh, to um, edit these sections adding more information and of course at the end we could um, export this to a document or put it on a wiki or something like that. Uh, so quite a simple script but um, it worked very well in practice.